So you've probably seen this generative hyperlapse effect online at some point, but here's how to recreate it with After Effects. Now I found this hyperlapse footage from Camille Gibelac, but if you want to shoot your own, just take a photo every step towards your subject with the same framing one step closer each time. Then play them back super fast. That's a hyperlapse. So with your footage in AE, set a marker where you want the effect to start and end, then duplicate your layer. Trim that layer to fit inside your markers. Now export just that section as a JPEG sequence, so now we have a photo for every frame. Now here's the fun part. One by one, open up your frame exports and use Photoshop's generative fill to make tweaks to elements like this window in each frame. Yeah, it's gonna take a while. What helps me get the best prompting results is using a custom GPT like this one to help me write better prompts specifically for Photoshop. Now, once you've tweaked each frame, export them and bring them back into After Effects and line them up with their original frame for an effect like this. 